Hello, everyone. Today, we will teach you the entire process of how to make your DTD. The first thing you need to do is put on the protective suit and tie it around your waist. Then, use a loop of duct tape to secure it in place to prevent the suit from being too loose and affecting the accuracy of the measurement. Please note that this measurement will directly affect the fit of the fursuit. Next, you need to secure the wrists and ankles. Use duct tape to secure the crotch area and, as shown in the video, wrap it around the upper part of the thighs to secure it in place. Be sure to fill in any gaps between the tape edges. To avoid arm fatigue from prolonged arm raising, we recommend you start with the lower body. When working on the upper body, find two supports to rest your arms on to ease the strain. Once you have completed the lower body, you need to move on to the upper body. Continue taping along the joints, being sure not to leave any gaps. The key here is to keep the surface smooth. If there are any wrinkles, add an extra layer of tape to smooth them out. If needed, you can also add a bit more tape for extra strength to prevent any potential damage during the construction process to ensure that the fursuit fits properly. After that, check one more time for any missed gaps. Mark the location of the elbows and knees on the back of the DTD with a cutting line to make placement easier later. After marking up the front and back, carefully cut along the line. Next, reattach the cut DTD back together. Line up the edges according to your marks and secure them in place with duct tape. Fill in any gaps or openings with tape. Then, using duct tape, Securely attach the suit back together, as if it was never separated. Finally, write down your name, height, and weight on your DTD. In this way, you've completed your DTD. Thank you for watching.